And in the replay, this just looks like a monster flat gap. I'm surprised I was able to actually land that. So it's been a while since I've done any Skate 3 challenges from you guys. So I thought, why not do a video today? And you guys have been posting some things on the Discord. So let's check out this one from Skate444. Let's see what he's got. So that actually looks pretty nice. <laughs> I think that's from right here. So let's go to the top and I think he did a uh, hippie jump, and then a late 360. I can't remember what kind of grind he did, but I'm not worried about the grind. I just want to do the hippie jump, late 360, and land into a grind. And I think he started from right here. So let's try this out. Wow, I'm going to need to time my hippie jump better. All right, hippie jump, nice. And he, he's not going to catch the board for some reason. So let's try this again. Maybe if I do it earlier, he'll catch the board. There we go. There we go. Okay. So that's how I'm going to be able to do it. Oh, oh. Oh, man. A late 540. That would be sweet. So maybe I should try to one-up him and do the late 540. I mean, why not? If we can do it, why not? All right. Ah, uh, so close. <laughs> I'm really close to it. Now I just got to land it. Okay, ah, uh, just a late 360 and not a very clean one either. I'm trying to shoot for that 540. Get on the board. So the late 540 isn't that difficult, but the problem is I can't aim for that ledge. I mean, I did really good right there, but unfortunately it wasn't the 540. It's just hard to aim where I can't see the rail. Uh, uh, whatever, whatever, dude. Yes, yes, really sketchy, but I got it. <laughs> so after all those tries, I'm still not satisfied with the sketch. So we're going to try it again. Okay, yes, 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 yes. Nice. Okay, so our next challenge comes from Dan, and he just posted a picture of what he wants, and he says, Gap the Manny Pad. Okay, so it is a pretty good size Manny Pad. We will need some speed for that, but first, there will be traffic coming, so I need to block the traffic. Let's use a traffic barrier. We'll put one right there, and I guess right there, just enough to block the traffic off. And then we're going to have to set a slide over there, but I need to get on top of that roof too. And we'll just come from the back side. I'll just use the manual pad glitch to get up there. So I place my marker right there. And then we'll place some manual pads down. Come on, manual pad glitch. Hope you work. That's high enough. And boom, there we are. Set my marker right here. And we'll do another manual pad glitch. All the way up. There we go. And boom. Okay. Now, <laughs> even another manual pad glitch. And we finally made it to the top. Okay, now let's get a run and start. We'll pop an ollie, find out where we're gonna land. All right, do I even need a slide? Let me check. Maybe I can just land in the grass and roll away. Ah, I don't know if it's gonna work without a slide. You know what? Instead of trying that over and over again, just to be safe, let's put up a slide. And I guess right there we'll do. And let's try to do, I don't know, just a backside heel over it let's land the slide nice and i don't know i don't know where i'm going to go after i land i need to figure that out too but yeah just a backside heel okay come on backside heel didn't even have a chance to pop i've got to be really quick with that all right come on come on back heel oh barely barely i almost got it I don't know if I'm going to be able to do a back kill over it. <laughs> I'm really trying here, but I just don't know. I'm so close to it. Okay. I can do a back 180, I guess, but not a back kill. And I'm just going to place a quarter pipe right here just in case I do land it because I don't want to mess up over here and then have to do it again. I want a clean roll away. Yes, got him. 
<laughs> that took forever, but I'm glad I got it. Now that challenge reminded me of another flat gap that I've been wanting to do for a long time. So let's go check it out. So the gap is right here around one of these old factories. I'm going to show you guys real quick what I'm talking about. And maybe you guys recognize this stair set from a video I did like, I don't know, over a year ago. I was just playing around on this stair set, land a couple tricks down it. But in that video, I got a comment from um, from Sherman Tang and it says you should do a gap from this platform to the platform with the pipe on the left. And I'm assuming that he's meaning this platform right here all the way over to the next platform. It's a big flat gap. And unfortunately, I don't think I can really stack any objects in here to gain a lot of speed. So I'm really going to have to figure this out another way. I think I can start from the outside on this. I could probably stack some objects up really high over there and then have a speed ramp over here. And then I'll have to set a launch ramp somewhere down here to launch up to there. And I should be able to carry that speed through this and hopefully have enough to actually do this flat gap. So I'm going to set my marker right here and then I'm going to do a manual pad glitch to make it all the way to the top or at least as high as I can go. Let's try to make it up to the top nice and then jump oops jump up here there we go i think i'll place the container right there and then i'll jump on top of it set my marker come back over here there we go and then place some manual pads and i should be able to get up a lot higher so there we are with that let's go ahead and make it to the top boom i set my marker i would like to land on that pole now i'm going to replace those manual pads with these containers i guess up to right there is how how high i was there we go I'm going to try to make it onto this pole. All right, here we are. And I guess I'll stack some manual pads up to right there. Hopefully it'll just glitch me to the top. There we go. All right, let's hurry up and try to stack some more manual pads as high as we can, make it to the top, and then replace those manual pads with some more containers. Hopefully I can get three more containers on here. And there is six containers. Let's glitch to the top of it. There we go. Nice. Let's go ahead and drop down. And I'm thinking about putting my speed ramp somewhere right here. And this is all basically a rough draft. I don't expect it to be perfect right out the gate. So I will make some adjustments. I need to add some more stuff here. So I decided to build this so I don't have to worry about popping up off of like any kicker or a launch ramp or anything like that. I should just be able to roll up and then over that. And I have everything set up now. As you can tell, I have like what, six containers stacked on top of each other. So yeah, I'm gonna to try to drop down into this speed ramp, hopefully get enough speed to then launch up this right here and then gap through here and hopefully have enough speed in the end to clear that gap. So let's go ahead and try this. So let's try to drop in. Oh, wow, too far out. <laughs> let's try this again. Yep, still too far out. I need to, I need to figure this out. Oh, maybe. Wow, so much speed. Okay, come on. Come on. Oh, okay. It looks like it's going to work. I just need to make it past that pillar. This pillar right here. And uh, and since I'm wanting to ride through right here, I feel like this pillar might get in the way too. So, we're just going to have to work with it. Oh, oh. That was pretty smooth. Ah, ah, man. I was really close to that. I just... I clipped right there at the end. Well, really more than a clip, more like ram my board straight into the wall. At least I'm getting close though. I feel like it's going to work. Yep. It looks like I was right. That pillar is definitely going to be a problem. He wants to wall ride it, but that's not at all what I want. <laughs> so I got to have good aim for this too. I'm going to be here forever. All right. All right. Now, ah, uh, why? I'm so close, but I'm so far away. This is the most complicated flat gap I think I've ever done. Just because of the run-up. If it wasn't for the run-up, I feel like I would have already made this, but the run-up is just so complicated. And it looks like some of my containers have disappeared. So, so I'm going to try to reset the objects and hopefully make the containers come back. Like I said, I really don't want to do this over again. Look at them. They're just missing. Oh, oh, they're coming back. I think they're all back now. Oh, I think, I think maybe I got it. I don't know. Let's go up and try this out. Yep. I think, I 
think I'm back at the top. Okay, let's try this again. It looks like I got all my containers back. Come on. Oh, nice, nice. Yes, I got it. <laughs> I got it. I can't believe it. And it sort of looked like first try after I reset the containers, but you know, it took a lot of tries to do that. And I think that's going to do it for this video. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure to hit that like button. If you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to hit that bell so you actually get notified when I upload. Let me know what you think about this video in the comments below. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.